I'm afraid that I have some very sad news to announce for All Souls. Um, the news is that Rico Tice, after 29 years on the staff team here, is going to be moving uh, to a, a slightly different role from September. In a second, I'm going to ask Rico you some questions so we can yeah. understand better. I just want to acknowledge uh, nearly everyone I've told so far has burst into tears. Every time Rico and I have tried to tell someone, Rico has burst into tears. So I don't know if we can get through the first question. Yes. That would be good. Rico, part of your reason I know is that really you've ended up doing three, four jobs simultaneously for us to your full time around the world for All Souls. You're the evangelist at All Souls here. You're also massively involved in pastoral care for people's lives across the whole of the church. I think one reason people have been so affected by it is that, you know, Rico's been there when they were born, been there when they got married, been there when their mother died, been you know, at every event Rico's been there to care for people. Um, and you're now the father of teenagers. Um, so it's just all of that at once. So just t- tell us a bit about what that's been like. Yes, I think it is an integrity issue, Charlie. I mean, I, I love all souls. I, I, I love the church. And part of loving it is wanting to do your job properly. And really, my calling is to be an evangelist. And uh, that's becoming more and more complicated in the culture. And therefore, it really needs someone who's absolutely full on at all souls doing that job. And again, with Christianity Explored around the world, we've got half a million people doing that a year. Um, at the moment, we've got masses of prisoners uh, doing that we've you know there's just so much to do on that front then then at all souls just the the gospel pathway that people need to be on and the support they need both to do evangelism and then if they're non-christians coming to faith again there's a vast amount of labor there and then there's the pastoral care of the church family that one's known for 29 years and, and, and you love them but again those things when I, I put them all together I'm just unable to do it and I'm getting older I'm 56 although my hair is good and, uh, uh, you know, I just, I've just got to the point where I, I, I can't do that. And, I, and I'm really excited about it. A younger man coming in and, and doing my role as evangelist. I feel I'm leaving um, All Souls. Coming off staff, I'll be a mission partner, but I, I'm leaving All Souls with a really excellent leadership team in place. And um, I give thanks for your leadership. And I just basically want to spend the next 12, 15 years of my ministry um, uh, getting people to look at Mark's Gospel. It's just a very simple aim. And All Souls has given me the platform to do that. It's given me 28, 29 years of setting up Christianity Explored. Now I just want to make the most of the opportunity All Souls has given me. So the plan is um, you're not going anywhere until September? Yes, going to be leading Cornerstone, come to Cornerstone, the church holiday, but then coming off staff end of August. And the idea is you'll... You'll go to a local church near where your in Ealing, near, is. near Ealing, where my children's school is. You're quite excited about the idea of being an evangelist in a yeah in, in a, a local, local church. church. Often, one of the biggest crits has been Rico. We hear what you say about evangelism, but you are at an exceptional church, which I am. It'll be really exciting to be at a local church trying to get Christianity Explored going. So we're going to a, a church in Ealing and just seeing what evangelism's like there, but then, yeah, working for Christianity Explored. So just being a volunteer at a local church, that'll be lovely, just being a member of the church family. And then as well, you know, there are lots of opportunities in terms of um, encouraging people that run Christianity Explored, going to their churches, perhaps preaching on a Sunday to get people on courses. So, you're, yeah, your job will be at Christianity Explored full It time. will be. I'll be the Christianity Explored evangelist. So we're aiming for a world where you have one job rather than five. That's yes. The, that's the goal. And But we... We hope we will see you often, so you'll be a mission partner, you'll keep close links with us. You'll... I really hope to be at the prayer gathering each month as a mission partner. That I'm thrilled that we've been allowed to be mission partners. And uh, and, and again, we, we, we just see ourselves still as part of the All Souls Church family. But yes, moving um, really for gospel reasons, so that we can take the opportunity that Christianity Explored has given, but also give the opportunity for someone to come here and think through evangelism for their generation. Um, and, you know, that's what I was allowed to do. And if I may say, I'm just incredibly grateful to the church family for the opportunity I've had. Um, I, I need to mention, just for our church family, you, you'll know that Rico works very closely with Grace. Um, and uh, obviously there are discussions going on yes. with Grace. And I think she would prefer it if, you know, everyone in the church family didn't queue up to ask those questions. Um, everyone has this huge 
at hugely high opinion of Grace, and and mm. we will will want to make sure that she ends up where she wants to be. Um, but please don't kind of ask her. Just, just yeah. tell us how we can pray for you, Lucy, and the family. You're oh. moving house. You're moving church. Yes. Moving job. Yes. Well, tr- trying to sell a, a cottage my parents left me down in Hampshire and buy somewhere in Hanwell. That's a big thing. If you could pray for that. Um, uh, again, the family moving. We like. We haven't yet got a school for Mercy, and then finding our way into a, a new church, which will be. I mean, in one Thessalonians three, Paul says, "My heart's been torn out. I've been torn away from you." So we know this is going to be emotionally very, very hard, even though it's the right thing for the gospel. So I think for that, and then for the kids creating relationships at the church they go to, but at the same time, a rhythm of life for me of 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 you know coming into the office here. Um, creating those um, connections and relationships that are good for Christianity Explored. So all those things, yeah. Rika, thank you. We, we'll, we pray for you. We'll, um, people will want to expect, we'll have all sorts of farewell things and ways of expressing gratitude and appreciation and we'll, we'll announce all those in due course. But for, for now, Rika, we're just thank you. We're so grateful for everything you've done and will do this year. You still work here. Yes. Um, and um, and we'll, we'll follow up. Yeah, and if I can just say, we're just immensely grateful to this church. We've loved it. I've loved being here. And now let's proclaim the gospel at Christmas.